Hi guys, I'm Darren, and in this video, I'm gonna show you how to calibrate your gimbals in EFOS. All right, so let's jump straight into it. For this demo, I'm gonna show you how to do this on the twin light, but it's basically the same on all the other radios. What we need to do is go into the system menu, and we're gonna to go to hardware. And in here, you'll see this option for analogs calibration, and that's what we're gonna click. So we're gonna to go to this page, which is basically just a demo page. You don't need to do anything at this point, but on the next page, what we need to do is center all the sliders and switches. So these back ones on this transmitter don't have a central detent. So sort of just eye it up. And on this radio, again, all we really have is the gimbal. So we're just gonna make sure that the throttle is nice and uh, flush at both sides, because we don't really have much to go on. So just make sure that the gimbals are central. And then what we can do is click the calibrate button. Now this is where it's gonna ask you to center your pots and sliders and gimbals. We've already done that. So we're just gonna click next. And now we need to do the move. Now I'm gonna do one control at a time. So I'm gonna do the slider first, go all the way one way and all the way the other way. The same with the other slider. If you've got pots on the radio, you can do the pots. If you have got an X20 with that slider, you can do that. Uh, of, of course, on the X20 and X18, the sliders are on the side. And now we come to the gimbals. One thing I should have said with the sliders, don't sort of force it, do all this quite gently. And especially true with the gimbals. So what we're gonna do is do one axis at a time and don't sort of bang around to the corners, that's not helpful, especially if you have plastic gimbals. What we're gonna do is gently go to the full movement and then gently go back to the other movement. As soon as you feel it just stop, that's as far as you need to go. Don't force it further or you'll end up with a calibration, which means you can't quite get to the full extremes. Again, especially with the plastic gimbals. So we're just gently touching the extremes, just making sure that it goes one way to the other. And finally do the same with the throttle and just a gentle touch. And that's it, that's calibration done. So next we click the next button and we can just confirm everything's working. So when we operate that slider, it's going all the way and it will stop where we want it to. Same with this one. And the gimbals are going to their extremes too. Once we're happy, we can click confirm. And that's it, calibration is done. So there you go, guys. That's how to calibrate the gimbals in EFOS. I hope you found this video useful. If you did, please remember to give it a thumbs up and also click the subscribe and bell icon. That can help get this video out to more people so they can learn how to calibrate their gimbals and sliders and pots too. Thank you very much for watching, guys. See you on the next one. Fly models like you stole them.